Do you see that? That's a head or a balk of cabbage. We're going to be making some fried cabbage today. Yes, fried cabbage. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to peel the leaves of cabbage off and you're going to cut around the stem. You're going to break the cabbage up and you're going to place it into a big bowl of salt water. Okay? Okay, guys, so this part right here You're going to remove that. Cut around that. Like that. It's kind of sort of the way I taught you guys how to prepare collard greens. Even want to break them up a bit like that. And then sit them in that bowl of salt water. Okay, guys, so we're all done. We're going to let this sit in this salt water solution. For a while. And we'll drain it when we're ready to cook it. Okay guys, so the ingredients and seasonings that you're gonna need are black pepper, sugar, hot sauce, salt, and crushed red peppers. You're gonna also need some pork bacon. If you don't eat pork, you can leave the bacon out. You're going to need one medium to large size onion. We're going to be using about one fourth red bell pepper and about one half green bell pepper. So let's chop this up now and fry our bacon. So slice your onions into long pieces. We're not going to be dicing these up into really, really small pieces. Okay. So that's the way your onions should look. We're going to be adding lots of onions to our fried cabbage. Only going to be using about one fourth red bell pepper, and that's just for decoration purposes. So there go our green peppers, red peppers, and onions. So we're going to place our bacon into the frying pan. And we're going to use the oil that the bacon produced to fry our fried cabbage. We're not going to be adding any for you. Bacon creates its own oil. Okay, so we're going to cut our fire off and we're going to remove the bacon. And the remnants from the 
bacon is going to also give the cabbage a good flavor as well. So our bacon is nice and crispy. I'm going to break them up. Like that. We're going to add our vegetables. Scrape up the remnants of the bacon. We're going to add our cabbage now. We're going to add our bacon. and our water. By the way guys, for all of the exact measurements, check my video description box below. We're gonna let this cook. It may look like it's a lot of cabbage, but trust me, it is not. This ain't nothing. One bulk or head of cabbage is only enough for like three people. Four people, maybe even five if you're serving it as a side dish and you're only serving everybody about a small portion. But yeah, it's not going to feed many people. Okay, so... It's going to shrink, it's going to cook down, and once the water steams out, it's going to begin to fry. By that time, the cabbage will be nice and tender by the time the water evaporates and steams out. Only going to use a small amount of pepper. going to use some sugar going to add some salt add a little more salt we don't have to add much seasonings at all I didn't add that much salt by the way I'm going to add our crushed red peppers. And I'll get back with you guys once it's all done. It's smelling awesome. I wish you was in here to smell the aroma of... Philly boy J. I said Philly boy J. Making the best. I said the best. Fried cabbage in the whole wide world. Don't nobody be.
fried cabbage like Philly Boy J. Listen, 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 listen. This fried cabbage is that to die for fried cabbage. I said, this fried cabbage is that smack your mother in the face fried cabbage. This fried cabbage is, it make a Christian want to backslide fried cabbage. Yes, 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 yes. And look at it frying. Oh. Look at the cabbage fry. Fry, baby, fry. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. The best of the whole wide world. Nobody made. Listen, I will pay you to find somebody that made cabbage like me. I'll pay you. You just don't do it. I don't care who you find in the world. It's just not going to taste like this. Unless they stole my recipe. It's not going to taste like this. Like, I'm the best on. This is the best fried cabbage on YouTube. The best on YouTube, guys. Once you make cabbage like this, you will never go back to making cabbage the way you used to. Never. It's frying now, guys. We're getting ready to take this out. Oh, yeah. When they get this look right here, that means it's done. Okay. When you get that look like that, that's how you know it's done. You cut the fire off now. See that? It's a little burnt in certain places. That's the way you want it to look. Maybe about, I don't know, a teaspoon worth of um, hot sauce. And look who it is, guys. Our infamous paper plate from 2015. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy this fried cabbage recipe. Because it is absolutely delicious. Philly Boy J, peace.